everybody it's the girl sash and i'm here with another video but this video is short and i am not gonna do much so as you can see i'm showing my curl activator gel and my black hair oil and those are the only two products that i will be using in my hair today i freshly washed my hair and all i'm going to do is twist my hair today <laughs> so i'm not putting in any false hair in my hair today i'm simply just going to twist it with my curl activator to check how healthy my hair is and to just give my hair a breeze like a little breeze you know a little break from all of that i know that false hair is supposed to be protective styles however i suggest that you breeze your hair every now and then so i'm simply just going to twist my hair today with some curl activator and that's about it <laughs> so i am going to do a little corner row or cane row at the front so as you can see i'm sectioning that part there's not much tutorial not much of a tutorial today but simply just how i twist my hair this hairstyle is some is a, basically the first hairstyle i've learned i learned to do on my own hair and i've been twisting my own hair since like grade five <laughs> grade five or six i've been twisting my own hair so um as i said my hair is freshly washed so i'm simply just detangling and i'm towel drying as always and i'm i start with the back of course and i section it in the size that i want i'm not using any edge control i'm not using anything other than my black ear oil and my regular oil my olive oil i forgot to show it in at the, the start of the video so my black ear oil my olive oil and the curl activator i paid 435 dollars for the curl activator and you can get it at any local store i got mine at um mandeville it is basically just a water-based curl activator and it smells like baby powder it smells it smells so nice when i put it in my hair jesus it smells so nice so as you can see i just use a little bit and i comb it through my hair using my fingers from the roots to the ends and i'm going to rope twist it well it was a rope twist because the hair was too wet or i would say too moist for me to rope twist so i just do a regular twist and that is it <laughs> yeah so that's the length of my hair um it shrinks back in like a second you just shrink and pew it just gone <laughs> so yeah that's that's the length of my hair um with no heat just my curl activator as you can see this is another video it shrink it just starts shrink immediately so um this is all i did with my hair for today and it's been two weeks and i still have this style in um it's just to get my hair to breeze and then to decide what i'm going to do with my hair next but that's about it So this is the entire back of my hair fully twisted and it really soft and it smells so good with the curl activator I really like it um it's just as I said this is just to give my hair a little breeze and to 
give me some time to help me figure out what I'm going to do with my hair next. As you can see, it starts to shrink. <laughs> So, um, as you can see, I'm just using a scissors to clip the little end part of my hair. Sometimes when you twist your hair, you notice that the very end, it looks damaged. So, I usually just clip it off. <laughs> People always say, oh, you can't use a regular scissors to clip it off. It won't grow back and blah, blah, blah. I've been using a regular scissors in my hair since, since forever. And... I have never had a problem with my hair growing back. I don't think my hair can tell the difference between a regular scissors and a hairdresser scissors. So I just clip off the little head, the little end that looks um, like it's damaged. And by damage, I mean it's just straight like cream hair or processed hair. So that little part, I just clip it off. Not much, not even a inch i would say it's just a little part just whatever part that looks damaged i just clip it off with our regular scissors and that is about it However, I'm um, differently using this curl activator. It it hasn't made my hair curly, so <laughs> I don't think it 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 actually work. But it's a great way to moisten my hair because when I use it, my hair usually feels really hydrated. However, to get it to activate like actual curls, I would not recommend it. Cause it doesn't it doesn't really maybe I don't have curls I don't know but it doesn't it doesn't activate my curls so to say So I'm on the last few and this was a fairly quick hairstyle and a fairly quick video. I didn't do much. I just twist my hair and as you can see I look like 12 again. <laughs> so this is this is one of my very um, hairstyles that I learned to do my hair on. So brings back a lot of memories you would say. And I'm just adding a little bit of the curl activator on the cornrows. But that's about it. It's just twist my hair with curl activator. Or you can use a moisturizer if you if you want. And just twist your hair to give your hair some breeze. And that's about it. You can flush it. And you, you also get to see if your hair is damaged and where it needs to clip or anything like that. And this is the back. As you can see, it, it will like just shrink up back. <laughs> So yeah, thank you for watching and stay tuned to see my next video for next week. That will be exciting. Bye.